There's a few ways to maintain a long ash on your cigar. To start, you get to make sure that you properly light your cigar. Now when you light a cigar, what you're going to do is you're going to take the torch and when you see the flame, that very tip of the flame is what you're going to be using to get the cigar hot. So what you're doing right here is you're toasting the cigar, you're making sure all the cigar on the foot is nice and red, make sure to spin it with your hand, move around the flame, make sure to get every single part toasted. You don't want to get too close or too far. Sometimes when you get too close, what happens is you burn the outside of the cigar, and that's what we're trying to avoid right here. So after the foot is nice, red, and hot, just put the cigar up to your mouth. Again, keep the, keep the lighter a good distance away from the cigar, just enough to get it hot. As you're puffing the cigar, move it around, and you're good to go. And that's how you keep a cigar lit properly. Once your cigar is lit properly, that's going to help prevent uneven burning, or your cigar from going out, stuff like that. To maintain the long ash like this, you want to make sure that when you puff on the cigar, you're not puffing too fast or too slow, nice and easy. It comes natural. Usually it ends up being about 45 seconds if you're not yapping like I am right now. Another tip to help make sure that your ash doesn't fall is to keep your cigar upright for the most part. When you have a cigar with solid construction, it's uh, a lot easier to maintain your ash. It won't fall off as easy. The benefit of having your ash stay on the cigar, it's not you know so much as a flex, but it actually helps keep the cigar lit longer. If you're constantly ashing your cigar, uh, you run the risk of having your cigar burn uneven or going out. So having that ash on there actually helps keep the heat in a little bit. It helps maintain an even burn. But also, you know, back to the flex part, it just kind of goes to show how well the cigar is constructed. It's almost like a tribute to the maker of the cigar. They took their time to perfect it, to roll it properly, and to make sure that you are smoking an absolutely perfect cigar, just like this one.